What's shaking Wix Nation? MPS here from Wix Training Academy and today I'll be showing you very quickly how to add a members area in Editor X by Wix. That's right, Editor X, Wix's new love, the responsive editor which makes you happy, which makes me happy, which makes our viewers and users happy because it is responsive and available on your mobile phone. I'm going to show you how to add the members area today. If you haven't already joined our Wix Nation community, make sure you go ahead and smash that subscribe button, turn those bell notifications on so you don't miss any Wix training content here on the channel and you'll instantly plug into the largest Wix training community on the internet. And oh, by the way, did I mention that if you head over to wixtrainingacademy.com and click join the academy, you get access to a bunch of free Wix training content I've got. I've also got a paid course on there as well if you'd like to check that out. But other than that, I'm going to go ahead and zip up the mouth and jump into today's video. All right, guys, so we're going to come here. We're going to click Editor X. We are going to just click Other in this case. And this is going to be the starting point for our Editor X. And I am actually going to start from a blank canvas. Why? Because I feel like Picasso on a blank canvas. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, mainly just because... I'm not doing anything special in today's video uh, with, in terms of design or anything like that. I am strictly going to show you how to add a members area to your Editor X website since so many of you are starting to move over to Editor X and I totally understand the reasoning. Um, so this is going to be a very, very quick video. Here's what I'm going to ask you before I start. One, make sure to hit the like button down below if you haven't already and two, Comment and let me know if you've been enjoying the content on this channel and what other Editor X videos you would like to see on the channel because there is a world of opportunity to explore here with Editor X and I want to get your feedback and create videos you want to see before I start doing videos I think you'd like to see. So that would be much appreciated and comments help the video as well as the channel uh, and they help me understand where you stand and what you'd like to see. So now, adding a members area in Wix, what is this good for, uh, or in Editor X, what is this good for? Well, obviously it adds membership functionality to Editor X, and membership functionality allows you to do a whole lot of things. You can have blogs, you can have forums, you can have subscriptions, you can create a membership website, uh, you can have uh, members on your online store. Members are a basic backbone functionality for a lot of new age websites that have any slight bit of community or personal information stored on a website. So it's important to know how to add the membership area here on Editor X. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go up to add and you are gonna scroll down our ad list to members and you are going to click add to site for the members area. Wix is going to work its Wix magic just like we love and appreciate and adore, right? We love when Wix works its magic, especially when it's an Editor X and it's responsive. And Wix is then going to add a members area to our site, okay? Um, now, a couple of things. One, the uh, login bar is added up here. So we've got a menu over here on the right. I'm going to move that for the time being. Login bar is the first thing that gets added. So this login bar is going to be your universal login uh, for your members. This is where they can sign up, register, or uh, log in and log out. This bar right here. However, if you want a custom login and registration for your Wix website, I've got some uh, videos that you can go check out in the cards. I've also got up in the cards the link to join WixTrainingAcademy.com for free. Okay, so that's the login bar. Um, however, now you'll notice, okay, well, where's the members area? Well, we're on the home page right now. If you click our page manager up here, you'll see members area, you'll see my account. If you click my account, this is the members area that gets set up for your members area here on Wix. So 
with your members area, again, I'm gonna say this several times over, you can have so many different members pages here, depending on the different Wix apps you have. You can have uh, Wix subscriptions, if they have access to a paid plan or a membership site, they can have challenges, they can have um, my purchases, my wallet, my orders, they can have um, my posts, my likes, my comments, if you've got a forum, all of these different things can be added, um, but it all stems from right here, my, my account page. And also, if you went back to add elements and you scroll down to the members area, you can also add these different member elements. Number one, the login bar, the member menu, which is already added right here, the profile card, which is already added right here, and or another member page, um, and this, or a members page, excuse me, this will display a directory of all the members on your website. Maybe you've got a forum where people want to be able to access that. And so that's how you add a members area here in Wix. Now, again, I've done some videos, well, a, a, I can't even count the number of videos I've done on the classic editor with membership stuff, online courses, uh, forums, blogs, uh, all that good membership community building stuff I've done on the classic editor. I would like to know in the comments if you would like me to do that same thing with editor X and let me know what you would like to see first. Otherwise, that's how you add a members area here on editor X. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's short, sweet, to the point. But it's important to know how to do this and how it does differ from the classic editor because this is a different look. It's a bit of a different process. Um, it's certainly clean looking and it's responsive, which is the most important part, but it's a different process. The way you design certain things and functionality wise is at its core the same, but different in terms of actual application between the editors. So I hope this was valuable to you. And I would kindly ask that you drop a like down below if you haven't already. Make sure to comment, like I said. And if you haven't already, make sure to smash that subscribe button. Turn those bell notifications on. You'll instantly plug into the largest Wix training community on the internet. I would love to have you. This community only continues to grow thanks to you. And I would love to see you here more often. Collectively, as a community, we would love to see you here more often. And remember, you can get free Wix training content, a whole bunch more, some workshops, et cetera. If you head over to wixtrainingacademy.com, click join the academy. It's free. And I do have some paid stuff over there if you'd like to check that out as well. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I'll catch you on our next one.